Welcome back guys to Factorio Town Season 2. This is episode 192. 192. With me, Massive Dynamic. This series has gone on a lot longer than I expected it to go on. But you guys have been supporting it. And I appreciate it very much. So we're here restocking on some items so that we can continue our work up here at our new town. Which I, again, Peachow, which I forgot to put install the radars at. But, uh... Anyway, hello Peachow, thanks again for the comments. Uh, Bubloop, Mr. Washington, all you guys who've left comments. If I've forgotten anybody, I'm sorry. Uh, I know I always forget. Um, but uh, those are the ones that are on my mind because of your regularity and I appreciate it very much. Oh yeah, um, you know what? Uh, one of you guys reminded me who I was looking for in the last episode when I was... Um, Hold on, I'm going to look it up now because I've forgotten. I'm going to look it up while we're restocking. Give me a second here. It was... Uh, uh, let's see here. Um, Robert Miller, yeah, Robert Miller. Yes, you reminded me that I was looking for, and I forgot his name again, John Goodman. Yeah, John Goodman, who's uh, who I was talking about uh, a couple episodes ago. And uh, yeah, thanks, Robert. Appreciate that. So uh, welcome new subscribers. Oh, yeah. See, speaking of new subscribers, we actually have a few new subscribers to welcome to the channel. So if you guys haven't left me a comment uh, to let me know you're here, please do that so that I can call out your name. And we are up to, believe it or not, 415. We had a run on subscribers this weekend. It was a really good weekend. I appreciate that, you guys, very much. And uh, I don't know what prompted it, but it was good news to me. We went from 400 to 415 in the course of, uh, what is today? Today is Tuesday. So I think between Saturday and Tuesday, we uh, made that jump. So we're going to hang about here for a minute while our uh, robots load us up with stuff. Meanwhile, back over here at our um, power plant, we have our yellow spider reloaded and ready to move in with uh, items to continue to build the power plant over there. So we'll let him do his thing while we uh, get filled up. Looks like he's got a bunch of uh, high pressure or high temperature pipes on him that he's filling in right now. And what else do you have? Uh, you have a bunch of turbines, which is great news. What else do you have? Copper is still our thing. So we have to kind of just take him over here, let him run his course with items and then we might have to check for other things that we need to install over there 1500 items to be exact uh yeah a lot so we just have to let it take the time that it takes to get it done looks like that's all we had on that load so we're gonna uh, move him over here and i guess we'll just bring him back to forza while while we're doing our thing over here and we'll just plot him a course right back to Forza right here and looks like we're all loaded up so we can plot our course um, let's see we want to plot our course up here to uh, we're gonna make a quick stop here to drop off a um, storage chest and then from there, we're going to go up to uh, Peachow to continue our work on that town. So in the meantime, in case you're new to Factorio Towns and this is your first time catching us, then let me just go over what towns are. Towns are a different way of playing Factorio where we don't build a main bus and we, we do a lot of spaghetti and we do a lot of trains but we do not do a main bus and we don't do city blocks. What we do is build towns and each town manufactures an item or two, sometimes 
a few, depending on the town, like for instance, Brook Fitch here, where we make uh, all kinds of things nuclear re related. Uh, so also the thing is that we name our towns after our subscribers. So as you'll notice, this town here that we're working on is called Pichal, named after a subscriber uh, who speaks to us only in Russian and uh, leaves us a comment on nearly every video in Russian that I have to then translate. And sometimes I respond back in Russian, which I do not speak, but I use Google Translate. So hopefully Google Translate is accurate and I'm not saying something terrible to him that I don't mean to say. Uh, but Pichal is a very faithful subscriber and commenter and we appreciate it very much. And we show that appreciation by naming a town for him. Another town that we're working on here is this giant nuclear power plant, which is a blueprint created by our good friend, Mr. Washing Toad, who is also a member of our Discord and contributed the blueprint via Discord. And so we incorporate it into the towns. Now, if you would like to do any of those things, uh, first of all, subscribe, leave a comment, let me know you're here, and then we'll add your name to our list of those who have done so and get your name on the on the list for having a name a town named for you and when we do that then we'll build a town unless you build it yourself which you can do by joining our discord if you join the discord let me know you want to play then we'll set up an appointment and get you in here and you can build your own town like laura did laura haneke who built uh, actually several towns and she actually had the freedom to build her towns and name them after her own friends so she named them for um, uh, she, she built a bunch of towns and she named them all uh, after her friends so you can do that also uh, one of them is a nuclear power plant that if I can find it it's her no yeah that's it Lucy K so you can do that also those are your options the other option is you can just watch and uh, if you do watch then why not at least stick around for the entire video that would be great and then after that beyond that i guess i could say uh why not leave a like and a comment um and or subscribe and if you haven't done any of that then i don't know what else to say to you i don't know why you're watching youtube if you're not going to contribute uh youtube is a it's it's a one-way platform but in a way it's a two-way platform if that makes any sense at all and I don't know that it does, um, but I think that you know what I'm talking about when I say it. So that's all I'm going to say about that. In the words of my good friend and hero. Um, okay, I need your help again. What's his name that said that? All right, name. Tell me who said that. That's all I have to say about that. Who said that? I'll tell you, it's a movie quote. Um, it's the character that said that. If you can tell me that character, and then for bonus points, tell me the actor. Uh, that would be that would be something. Uh, help me out there because, as I said, I am extremely forgetful. I forget only the important things. I remember the goofy things, like I remember the line, but I don't remember who said it. So uh, let's see, let's get rid of these cliffs here because we're going to do another. Uh, yeah, so right now Forza is running behind on production and it's all due to, well I can only say it's my fault. Let's take a look at Forza. Uh, well actually what it's due to is all the work it's doing on spiders and things which I probably need to shut all that stuff down at this point um, because I've got all the spiders that I'm going to need and um, I need to catch up on building materials uh, yeah I think that's probably what we're going to have to do right now I, I think I did shut down a bunch of it between episodes actually uh, but I need to shut it down more and just concentrate on the things that we actually need because uh, we're making too many things that we do not need and it's eating up all of our resources uh, like these lasers. Okay, I did shut that. I guess I could shut it down right here while I'm looking at it. All right, what is running that doesn't need to run? Okay, you guys, you guys don't need to run anymore. Let's cut you off. Uh, we'll just remove the inserter, I guess. Probably the easiest way to do that. Uh, you don't need to do that anymore. 
Okay, what else? You, we don't, okay, we shut you off. That's fine. That is fine. We need those. Um, we don't need any more of these, but that's shut off. Okay, we do need those. Oh, actually, we don't need those, but we're not making any anyway. Um, actually, these we don't need. That's eh, not hurting anything. We're not making them. Okay, what else? Ah, here we go. These, we're still making these guys over here. We can shut that off. You're just eating up our resources. Um, speed threes, yes, we do need speed threes. We can't deny that. We do need a lot of speed threes. Now, most of our work should be... Uh, yeah, we're going to let the blue circuits continue to run. That's fine. Uh, because we do need those. Do we need those, though? I don't know. We get those delivered. We can probably shut this whole thing down, too. Um, yeah, let's shut this off. I think we shut this off right here. That will shut everything else off. Um, yeah, this, that, okay, that's, that's that. That'll shut all that down. And what else? It looks like red circuits is fine. Okay, all that is fine. Now, what do we need here? We need more steel, which I think we did. We worked on more steel, but we need more iron. And where's our iron train? It should be, okay, it's on the way. All right, that's all good then. Let's just take a look at, let's take a look at the train network and see, it looks like we have a bit of a traffic jam. Oh, it's moving. It's just jammed because it's jammed. Oh, uh, where are you going? You're going that way. Everything... There's our iron train there. Everything's moving. Everything is working as designed. So we're not going to complain about any of that. The network is all working. Everything is functional. It's just slow. So what we've done is we've taken on more than we can chew. When we, when we built these spiders and went... Went ham on building spiders. We just ate up all of our resources. Uh, so what we're going to do right now is we're going to make our way back to Forza. And we're going to park over here. We're going to build up some more resources. Well, maybe right there instead. We're going to build up some more resources. And we're going to come back to it uh, after we get a chance to um, restock everything. Because we are just, we're just wiped out of everything because uh, we spent everything on spiders and that is uh, a tragedy on the one hand but it worked out for our benefit in a way in that we have all this cool spider technology to play with uh, however I'm not sure that Iron Man the Iron Man suit was worth the investment. You know what I'm saying? Is that is that an analogy that makes sense to you guys? Um, I am not a not a comic book guy, but I did see the first Iron Man and enjoyed it. The second Iron Man was okay. The third one I thought was horrible. Um, I I uh, did not enjoy that third movie at all. Uh, but anyway, the analogy is that the suit itself seemed to be worthwhile in the moment but I don't know that it paid off in the end um, after the third movie uh, although there's many reasons why the movie failed I think mostly because it was just a horrible movie um, but other than that there's probably other factors involved that I'm not going to get into because I'm, I'm actually at the limit of my knowledge on the subject. So I'm not going to go any further on that subject. What we're going to do right now is we're going to end this episode. Well, I'm going to quit while I'm ahead. We will pick it up again in the next episode when we will talk about random crazy things. Uh, we'll build more factories. We will try to get our power online and perhaps do some other things that might surprise you. So we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.